mightily kayaba kayaba baba baba maso prashegere bode ah let things begin to change yes you are entering you are entering bakala baba yes you in Jesus name we pray amen you may be seated amen let us open our Bible to Matthew 6 33 it's a popular verse amen hallelujah amen yes this is what we also use amen to pray and to speak the word of God, amen, when we finish prayer, amen. Matthew 6, uh, Matthew 5, verse 16, amen. Matthew 5, 16, say, let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven, amen. amen. Let your light, amen. Let your light, hallelujah, amen. So shine before men. That's the first part we are going to use, amen. Let your light, what is it for your light? What is it that God is saying, amen? God is telling us that there is a light, there is a grace that is upon our life, a light that will clear away our ignorance. Hallelujah. That will clear away the things that we think we don't, we cannot do. Hallelujah. That light of illumination to find out, to understand that God has things and promises for us in his word. In him, as we are children of God, we are supposed to shine. Amen. That light shining on us is we understanding. Amen. That we are great. We are the children of God. Amen. We are created for greatness. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. To understand. Amen. For us to, you see, it is very important to ask God, Father, give me more information about myself. Who am I? What have you called me to do? What next? What am I supposed to do? Who am I supposed to be married to? What is happening in my life? What business do I supposed to have? All this is, is illumination. It's light. Light of God that will reveal those things to you. Amen. God wanted you to be great. He created you to be great. Amen. He ordained you to be great. Amen. He wants you to manifest. The Bible said the expectation, the, the whole uh, creation is waiting for the manifestations of the sons of God. So the earth is waiting for you to manifest. The trees are waiting for you to manifest. The wind is waiting for you to manifest. They are waiting for you to understand the greatness of God in you so that you can start exploring in that greatness which God has given to you. And how would you find out? By light, by illumination, by light coming inside you, revealing these deep things. Amen. 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 Isaiah says, he said, arise and shine. Amen. Stand up. Understand. No. Hallelujah. That's what that word arise means. Arise. Understand. Stand up. Uh, no. Hallelujah. See. Hallelujah. And shine. For the, for the, for the, for, for the glory of God has risen upon you. Amen. The glory of God, which is what makes things happen. The beauty, his presence of God has risen in you. That was since when you received salvation. But the Bible is saying, arise, manifest it, show it, reveal it. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. The Bible said, 
in that same Matthew uh, 5 16 said that they may see your good works amen so you're shining you're supposed to let people people are supposed to see you people are supposed to see the goodness of God in you you are the testimony you are the one that will reveal that God is good you are the epistle of God it, through your character through your behavior through what God has blessed you with people that used to know you before now when they see you they say wow this person do indeed serve God through you amen people look at you and they know that the goodness of God is all over you you are representing Jesus amen amen a reflection of the Holy Spirit amen you reveal the glory of God. Amen? Through the money that God bless you with. Uh, you use it to glorify God. Amen? Uh, the anointing of God upon your life is to change lives. Uh, is to glorify God. Everything you do. Amen? Hallelujah. That's where that last part comes. Amen? So men will see. Amen? Your, uh, your good works and glorify your father in heaven. Amen. So as you manifest, as God starts revealing you, it is to glorify him, not to glorify yourself. To promote the kingdom of God. Amen. The money God bless you with is to push his kingdom. The anointing that God bless you with is to push his kingdom. The place where you walk is to reveal his kingdom. Everything for you to be revealed, so people can see, is to glorify him. You and your husband serving God together, you and your children, signs and wonders, amen. A crown is given to you, a crown of righteousness uh, that you walk, amen. When you speak, people know, people will say, My God, what a nice person, amen. Oh, I'm not talking that everybody should like you. No, even people must not all like you because then there's something wrong. But people should be able to identify, amen. <laughs> amen. But people must be able to identify the fact that you are a child of God. You are different just to give God the glory. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Dominion, influence, glory, and your talent. Amen. The talent that God has given to you, that influence that you have. Amen. All is to glorify Him. Hallelujah. Amen. But what is this glory of God? Amen. What is this glory of God actually? Amen. Yes. Oh, then we'll go to Matthew. Amen. Matthew 6, 33. Glory has to do, amen, with doing what God wants. His will. His heart desire. What does God want? Amen. Yes. Hallelujah. How would you? Wow, what is it to glorify God fully? The Bible said in uh, um, Matthew 6, 33, but first, but seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added. Amen. 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 So, we have, God wants us to shine. God wants us to manifest. God wants to reveal himself to you. Amen. But there are some things, there are some terms and conditions that we have to do to manifest fully. That means you have to align to the will of God. Amen. His will is totally different. Amen. His will is not just pushing the kingdom with finance. His will is to win souls, to tell people about Jesus Christ. Amen. To be a, to be a, a witness. Amen. amen. Hallelujah. That means, amen, we have to then align to his will. Amen. Amen. 
niet alleen in onze financiën, dat zijn koninkrijk voorbeelden. Nee, het is ook door zielen te winnen. Getuigen zijn voor deze Dat is our mandate actually. Our mandate is that to, to, to manifest the goodness of God. To manifest Jesus Christ actually. To the extent that people's hearts will open for them to accept Jesus. Amen. That's why we are here. That's why we are saved. Amen. Amen. <laughs> By preaching the gospel, amen, not only standing here, but preaching the gospel. Our behavior, our conduct can be a gospel. Amen. At the place of your work, your contribution, amen, according to the way of the Lord. Do you know that if you are working and you are working diligently, you are doing the work from your heart and it's a boss that does not serve God and you are doing it well, you become very, very best in what you are doing. Do you know that this can bring the relationship closer that your boss can ask you, who are you? I'm a Christian. What church do you go to? Because of you, your boss can give their life to Jesus. Amen. Your words can change people's life. Amen. Showing love to people, even those we hate. Amen. Hallelujah. Your purpose, my purpose, is to walk and to do everything possible to reveal and to align to the will of God here on earth. And that is to save soul. Amen. Amen. I'm going to be done very soon because we still need to dedicate two kids. Amen. Hallelujah. You see, it is not only standing here preaching. Amen. It is glorifying God in everything you do. Amen. Glorifying God. Amen. Being a testimony. Amen. Being different. Amen. See the possibility of yeah, telling, Jesus, telling people about Jesus in every situation. Amen. You see, like the very, very, very that we are talking about, we are not preaching gospel everywhere like, oh, be saved or die. No, we are so, and then we can tell them about Jesus Christ. We need to build the relationship sometimes to be able to bring people to the body of Christ. Amen. Because, you know, relationship is what Jesus also have with us. Amen. Build the relationship, our character, our conduct, our behavior, our everything that we do, it should be what uh, we use to glorify God. God. Amen. We glorify him with what we do. Amen. 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 His kingdom, his purpose, his heart desire here on earth. Amen. For us to manifest and win souls. Amen. And to be an example. Hallelujah. To reveal who God is here on earth. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. You see, some of us are pursuing flesh. Flesh. I want to marry. I want to have money. I want to do this. It's all about ourselves. There is no, uh, nothing in there that you're going to put as a, 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 I don't know how to call it, as a, as a, like as a God, do this for me so I can do this for you. Amen? Father, let me get married so that we can come together, do the work of God. Amen? Father, uh, give me this. Amen. Anything that you are asked, let, it, let your motive be to glorify him. And you will see that you get that thing quickly. If our motive is only about flesh, about what we want, hallelujah, when Anna said, give me a, 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 a prophet, a child, a son, amen, and I will leave the son all the days of my life in your house. God was giving, Anna was giving God that child, even before that child was born. Just as we are going to dedicate these children, we give him to God, amen. Everything 
whereby you should be glorifying God. Not what we want, but amen. And in the midst of doing those things, we get what we want. SS. What is it? How do we do it? When we, our motive is strong, we want to marry, then we try to use sex to lure the person to marry us. That, that's flesh. That's not God being glorified. That's we doing it by our power. And at the end of the day, it blows on our faces. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Or using voodoo and winty to make somebody marry you. Ah, it's a big, <laughs> amen. Those witchcraft things that we do to, to, to manipulate somebody, God will judge us. God, you see, that thing is wickedness. When we start now showering, doing some kind of thing to put somebody in a box and try to manipulate them to become what we want, not knowing, not forgetting the fact that that person is not yours. There is a God that created them. And that thing that you are doing, it is dangerous. And you might not see it now, but continue to do it. There will be a time. Hmm? Justice will knock. <laughs> Of Winty. Oh, sell up, up your kindred and mark me. That is need from hot. Amen. Your kindred have an icon character. Same say from hot. Amen. Same to come on. Further in a play from Han. For now, the will from hot and who I can will. My need fear hexera. The kindred mark on. So as she will. It comes to tight your order of the of the door club. Hallelujah. Because that thing is demonic. Hallelujah. I already said it in Dutch. Amen. Hallelujah. So we, hallelujah, supposed to manifest the glory of God in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. So that means we, for God to trust you with his working power, we have to align. Amen. To apply his will, his condition, his term, so we can manifest lavishly, financially, in every way we do, and that God will be glorified. Amen. Amen. And we moeten in lijn staan met de wil van God, opdat God verheerlijk kan worden. Amen. Hallelujah, amen. When you align to the will of God, and then now you will start becoming that light. You will start becoming eh, that, that greatness that God is talking about, uh, that men will see and, and they will glorify God in heaven. When you separate yourself uh, and you say, God, I surrender. Most of us know that if God wants to deal with you and is calling you, you can't run away. He will follow you till you surrender. Amen? That's the good thing about God. His mercy endures forever. Amen. Amen. The light of God will shine through you. Amen. You will see Jesus revealing himself mightily to you. When the Bible said, when you, uh, the Bible said, when you lift me up, when I'm lifted up, I will draw all men to you. Amen. When he's lifted up, he will draw prosperity to you. He will draw breakthrough to you. He will draw blessings. He will draw all type of blessings to you in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Jesus will reveal himself. You will have access to mighty anointing. Anointing that people will not understand. How does this anointing come? Amen. It is because of the relationship that you have with him and that you have aligned with his will. Amen. What 
what is in line with him? That is you have, you love people and you want people to give their life to Jesus Christ. Amen. Everything you do is about pushing people towards Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Feeding the poor, helping the church, whatever it is, it is to glorify him. That should be our motives. Not for what we want, but what eh? to glorify him. Amen. And then you will see the Holy Spirit. Amen. Manifest mightily. Amen. Your prayer can never be hindered. There are new ideas. New ideas that God will start giving to you. When you open your mouth and preach, people will understand that the word of God will penetrate through you. Why? Because now you are a light. You are always been a light, but now your light is manifesting. Amen. You are the light of this world. Amen. As soon as we give our life to Jesus, we are a light of this world. But there's another level, another realm when your light is shining. And there is also another level where your light will shine mightily. Amen. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. And not only here on earth, when we are done, we will get the crown. Oh, Jesus. The crown. Amen. It's not ordinary crown. Amen. It is a, it, let's go to Daniel. Let me just show you an example of that crown. Daniel 12. And that will be done. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Daniel 12, 3. Daniel. Amen. Yes. Daniel 12, 3. Yes. God bless you, Jaden. Amen. 12, 3. Those who are wise shall shine like the brightness of the firmament, and those who turn many to righteousness like the star forever and ever. Do you see? Who turned many to righteousness? How many people are we telling G about Jesus? Amen? Somebody was telling me, I have to drag this person to church. Oh, that's it. Amen? You have to. Amen? Tell them about Jesus. Have patience until they join you to church. Amen? As you do that, God is giving you up. <laughs> the type of crown that you are going to receive after life. Amen? After life, hallelujah. After life and also here on earth, how God will exceedingly bless you because you are aligned to his heartbeat. What is his heartbeat? Jesus died for the whole world, not for some people. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Those who are wise, you have to be wise, shall shine. So your shining is attached to women's souls. Amen? That's the whole conclusion. For you to rise, for you to manifest the mighty glory, it's not only about binding demons, chasing demons, and hate everybody around you. No, you are limiting yourself. God is a God of love. Amen. It is for us to love people and win so. You can't hate people and win them to Jesus. Amen. And there you will shine mightily, like the brightness of the feminine. Brightness. You'll be so bright. You won't suffer. You can't suffer. It's not possible to suffer when you are a soul winner. When your heart desire is to bring people to church and tell them about Jesus, for them to be delivered. Amen. But if you say you are a Christian and you hate everybody and all you do is to chase people with your character, you are not just fighting yourself, but you are fighting against God. And it can be dangerous. Amen. It can be very dangerous. Hallelujah. I will tell you the truth. Whether you like it or not, it's the word of God. Amen. Amen. 
and those that turn many to righteousness like the stars forever. Hey, Father, use me mightily. Make me this, make me that. Now you know the secret. Go win souls. Amen. I want to be the richest person in this earth. Oh, for what? Go win souls. Amen. If you don't go out to preach Jesus, then let your character, amen, preach the Jesus. Stay in your, you can stay in your house and start praying for the whole, whole land to be saved. How many of us remember to pray that? We only pray for ourselves. We need to pray, amen, for our community, for our city, for the homo, for the, for the, for the, for the lesbian, for the witches and wizards, for the winters, for the voodoo priests, for the Muslims. We have to pray for all of them to be saved, amen, to be saved. It is not of God to hate people. If you are half a heart of hatred, then that, that, that's, that's demonic spirit that we have to allow God to go because God is a God of love. Amen? We have to love everybody, no matter how they are. Amen? We love them! I was, it was, I went somewhere uh, last week for a meeting, and this man is a Christian, but he's not shouting, uh, Jesus, this! He said, but he said, he's winning souls. Amen? He's winning souls. He goes to nightclubs with girls that are stripping and doing their thing. He entered there. He sits there. He even, he even, <laughs> hallelujah, amen. amen. He even pay for a hotel to bring girls in. And when they come in, he sits there and tell them about Jesus. Amen. Why are you doing this? He will pay them their money. They come, you know those old girls, they think they came to walk. They want to jump on immediately. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. I am here to talk, not to do this thing. Amen. Jesus loves you. Eh? Are you afraid this? And most of the time, these women start crying and they give their life to Jesus there. Amen. He paid them to win them. Amen? Amen. Well, we have Christians that are perverts that sneak to prostitutes. Holy Ghost fire! <laughs> Blood of Jesus. Amen? And the Holy Ghost is following them. And then when they are entering, Holy Ghost will be like, Hey? Hallelujah. And then they come and demonic spirit follow them. They carry the demon and then the Holy Ghost is far away looking. Hallelujah. Christians that are doing all nasty things. I don't know if I should call them Christians. Hallelujah. Amen. Our character, our conduct, everything we do is to glorify God. Amen. Let's give Jesus a clap offering. Amen. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. You see, this preaching also, when God was telling me this, it also it touched my heart because me too, I'm not there yet. Amen. Oh, yes. Amen. And I know that God is speaking to us. Amen. Let us love one another as Christ loves us. Amen. Yes. There's a crown that we'll get after all this. Amen? It's not about you and your, just your family. It's about every... It's about Jesus Christ. Amen? Yes. I want us to pray. Father, help me to be a soul winner. Amen? Help me to be a soul winner. One way or the other. Amen? Some of us. Amen? Uh, yes. Those, you know, there are many ways to win souls, actually. Yes. Amen? There are many ways to win souls. You can go to the street, tell people about Jesus. You can do it through your work. And some of you also are sending me to Africa or wherever it is when I'm preaching the gospel. When those people give their life to Jesus, amen, those people are also, uh, that is on your account, amen? Yes. I know that I want to call uh, Shannon mother and the mother of um, Skache, your mother. Lord, let's, let's pray for them, amen? Yes. And yeah, okay. Yes. Hallelujah. I want you to give your life fully to Jesus Christ, amen? Yes. Ik weet dat je God dient, maar ik wil dat je met mij deze gebed en dat je weder geboren. Het is iets anders, amen? Yes. Say after me. I believe. God is here. Era madu sheli kurabariesh. Ooh. 
Jesus. The blood of Jesus. We yes. know. Come out. Come out. Come out. Come out. Come out. Hey. Yeah. 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 Come out. We know. Come out. Come out.
I know you are the light of God. Jesus, come. Father, I pray that you will use him. No more attack. No more attack. That attack that is preparing to come. What fire! What fire! What fire! No more arrow. No more arrow from the lips. Lose! Lose forever! Lose it! You cannot destroy his life. You will not destroy his life. No more arrow. He will not have it. Not on Friday. Not in two weeks time. Not in three weeks time. Epilepsy. Die from your roots. Die from your roots. Lose it! Lose it! Lose it! Lose it! Lose it! Aha!